Joining me now on Twins Live is CEO of Second Harvest Heartland, Allison O'Toole. Allison, thanks so much for uh, coming downtown and visiting our studio. Thanks for having me. We're so thrilled to be here and to be part of this effort. Well, I don't think any of us could have planned for a global pandemic in 2020. Uh, as I mentioned, can't necessarily plan for something like that. But as a result, how has that kind of affected hunger and the need for food in the Twin Cities communities? Well, we're seeing the need just grow exponentially as we go into the fall and the winter. Um, and we're seeing hunger unlike we've seen in since the Great Depression, double what we saw since in the Great Recession about 10 years ago. So it's just, it's the worst crisis we've ever been in. And let me tell you a little bit about what that means for families. It means one in five Minnesota, one in five Minnesota kids doesn't know where their next meal is coming from, one in eight Minnesotans. And that means families are watering down milk, skip, parents are skipping meals to give their kids more. Kids are showing up to school hungry. We know hungry kids can't learn. And so we really need, this teamwork is the answer for us all to get through this, and we need the help now more than ever. Speaking of help, you have a lot of help from uh, all the Minnesota sports teams in the area. Who's all involved in the campaign, and what does that mean to you? It means so much to us, and you know, it is, it's everyone. It's the Timberwolves, it's the playoff-bound Twins, it's the Vikings, it's the Gophers, it's the Lynx, it's the Wild. We are so thrilled to have everyone joining forces, and um, you know, what a better cause to help our community. Those teams have fans all over the state, and I know um, this community will step up and continue their generosity. But it really, you know, more than ever, we need help stripping away the stigma from asking for help. Mm -hmm. And when your favorite sports team or sports um, player uh, steps up and supports this cause, it might help a few more people ask for help and feel okay about it. And that's what our mission is at Second Harvest Heartland, along with the other food banks. We're here to help this community get through this. A lot of people working from home right now. So for those tuning in right now, if they're working from their home office or simply on the couch, how can they donate and help? Go to twoharvest.org slash home teams and you can donate online. You can see all the auction items. They're awesome auction items. We're really excited about that. And the other thing is, you know, help us strip away the stigma of asking for I always think that it shows that you trust your community if you ask for help. And so many new faces are showing up um, at food shelves and meal programs to get a little help right now. And we didn't need to make sure it's okay to ask. Well, Allison, again, thank you so much for joining us in studio. We really appreciate it. Thank you. And go twins. Yes. Again, that website is twoharvest.org, correct? Twoharvest.org. Slash home teams. Slash home teams. There you go.